Justin Easter getting the call in goal against Ben Bonestiel and the Brantford 99ers. Coming off a nine-goal performance against Oakville, the Panthers hoping to stay hot offensively. Jack Dever doing the part himself, almost splits through the D, but uh, corralled and Bonestiel has the puck. So Dever denied in the first period. He won't be in the second as Ian Martin with a clever no-look drop pass that Jack will snap past Bonestiel for his second of the season. It's 1-0, and you got to appreciate that uh, Martin assist with another look. Martin going to work again the same corner of the rink. This time assists Chris Fugalis right into the boards with a solid hit. That's the good news for Pickering. The bad news is a few seconds later, Adrian Rabello sets up Jack Partridge, and we are all tied up at one goal apiece. Third period, Matthew Altimore can't grab the puck cleanly. That allows Jaden Lee to muscle his way in on goal. It doesn't get much on the shot. Easy stop for Easter, and the Panthers cash in the get-out-of-jail-free card. But moments later, Brantford's Ryan Vatanen wins a battle for the puck and sets up Kurt Watson for the go-ahead goal. Allowed to get away an uncontested shot and pops the water bottle. To the point, Simpson. Down low, rebound in front. Loose, who can find it? They score! Miles Perry gets the goal as he cleans up the loose change in front of the net. Thomas West, the voice of the Panthers on Hockey TV, describing this high in goal. Pickering, full credit. They really found their legs by this point in the game, and you could see that goal coming. 99ers with a chance at the kill shot. Easton Wainwright beats Easter, but catches iron so we go to overtime and always nice to receive a gift on your birthday that's just what Aaron Jessley receives as Zach Betts falls and allows Jessley to set up Lucas Rowe for the game winner Panthers seal the deal three to two Ian Martin leads the way with two helpers Miles Perry with his first Panthers goal and Rowe with the overtime dagger yeah, it was a big goal. Uh, I needed to get the monkey off my back, get the boys fired up, and I was just happy to pop my first one and uh, help my team move forward. Yeah, it wasn't our best performance, but uh, at the end of the day, the boys got it done, capitalized on our opportunities, and uh, we walked out the W. I mean, uh, you know, coach has been saying it for a while now. We, we haven't been having the greatest start, so that's one of the games. Same with the, the game before that. Um, but we end up bouncing back from it. Uh, we just got to find a way to figure it out earlier. Um, but once we get going, we're for the team to beat. I mean, uh, their defense on their team had the puck, and uh, I poke checked him, and then Jess grabbed it from him, and I went to the other side, and it was a great pass, great look, and got the finish on an easy shot.